chosen ones, you need to just go ahead on and let your enemy know that it's your turn. Mm. I want you to understand that some people that the enemy used never wanted you to have your turn. Some of you have been in positions to be promoted on your job, been in positions to even get a job, been in a position to take your life to a whole new level. And it was a devil inside of that person to prevent you from doing it. But because you have gotten back into alignment with that practices and the laws of God, because you are having a clean environment and a clean heart, because you are doing everything in your might to stay in the will of God because you have a one-on-one -on -one intimate relationship that you cherish above anything else they're gonna have to allow you to take your position they're gonna have to allow you to take your place they can't ignore you any longer I just heard God said it's your turn Oh, it's your turn. It's your turn. It's your turn, baby. They thought that you wouldn't get it into glory. Honey, glory is right here. It's your turn. It's your turn. It's your turn, baby. God is saying that you ain't got to die and make it to the next dimension to get what I promised you in this dimension. It's your turn. It's your turn. It's your turn, baby. Christ said, I came down here and I walked the walk and talked the talk for you. It's your turn. It's your turn. It's your turn, baby. Jesus said, I came down so that you could get a breakthrough. It's your turn. It's your turn. It's your turn, baby. Christ came down so that you could come up. It's your turn. It's your turn. It's your turn, baby. All hell done broke loose because you done woke up. I wanted to wake up this morning because I'm so very excited because you done woke up, baby. It is your turn. And it's nothing that no demon in hell can do to prevent you from getting what you what you prayed for, what you've been fasting for, what you've been meditating about, what you've been thinking about. Honey, whatever your energy goes, honey, whatever your focus goes, energy goes there. Whatever your focus goes, energy goes there. It's so easy sometimes for us to focus on what is going wrong in our life because the way that the human mind works, this is why the Lord doesn't mind you understanding how your body works this is why the devil doesn't want you to understand consciousness he doesn't want you to understand how your brain works he don't want you to understand what you're supposed to put inside of your body so that you can stay divinely connected to the frequency of god he wants you to be putting all this foreign stuff inside of your body so that you can never get a signal so that you can get the breakthrough i want you to understand that god is saying that it is very important for you to understand how your mind be working come on somebody the human mind that we inherited is designed to focus on problems. The enemy knows that if you put your attention on a whole lot of problems, that you are so magnetic that you will create more problems. But I'm living in a time now where people have began to say, okay, that's a problem. I got a solution. God is the solution. Okay, that's a problem. I got an answer. God is the answer. Okay, that's a problem. I see it happen. God done worked it out. I want you to understand that the more that you focus on what you want, or what you know that's yours or on the kingdom. Do you understand that wherever your focus goes, energy goes there? So now the question becomes, well, what happens then? What happens when I focus my mind on one particular area? You're telling me that where my focus goes, my energy flows to that area. So how do I know it's working? All of a sudden, things will just start. You'll get a release in your spirit first. All of a sudden, you'll get that phone call that you didn't know existed all of a sudden you'll get something in the mail that's giving you money that you didn't even know that you had all of a sudden everyone is treating you real real kind and everybody is so generous to you and it, it feels weird right but because you changed your focus on things above what happens is what you focus on above it comes below i want you to understand that it is spirits in the air and we connect to those that we are a match with. So if you have experienced a bunch of bad things in your experience, you are electric magnetic in individual. So what that means, it means that you need to change your frequency, change your position, change your posture. You need to stand up. You need to go ahead on and shine. Don't quench the spirit of God on the inside of you. Relax and let it come out. God is saying right now, it's your turn. 
I want you to think about that as you go out your throughout your day. It doesn't matter what it may look like. I want you to know that from a spiritual approach, you are winning. You are winning, baby, and you cannot be denied anymore because of who you are and who you're divinely connected to. And I just wanted to reach out and encourage you and remind you to stay consistent, baby, because it's your turn. Mm -hmm. Peace. And ain't nothing they can do about it. Bye now.